Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It is Sunderland, and they face Wigan Athletic. Well, it's been a long journey for both these teams, Derek. It's not been easy, but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves. No doubt both managers will have set out their game plans and made sure every player knows exactly what their roles are. What a game we have in store for us. Linden Gooch, number eight, Elliot Embleton. Well, let's run the rule over the Sunderland starting lineup. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. for Wigan Athletic. Well, no surprise really, they're matching up here, but there are many different ways they can approach this game. And I just think they'll be cautious today, certainly early on. And now they get the ball rolling. He's found a pocket of space. Now he must favour the cross, putting them under the cosh. Well, the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong, Stuart. Well, he has to make the keeper work harder than that. That's a tame finish. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, Derek, he comes into this game full of confidence because in the last match, he was outstanding. He got his two goals, but his general play made him the best player on the pitch by a long way. The high press was very much on. Moving forward effectively. Luke O'Neill takes the shot. What a block! Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, they won't come closer than that. So unlucky not to take the lead there. Gooch. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Lyndon Gooch. Lang. And a goal kick given. Neil, Luke O'Neill, Stewart, fruitful looking attack, can they forge ahead, they do, and you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. Goal 
the opening goal of the game then. Cousins. Tom Naylor. Now can they make something happen? But they dealt with the threat first. Corey Evans. Promising looking attack. Good. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. And an astute piece of defending. Over the touchline for a throw in. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Charlie White. Oh, good vision. And touched onto the frame of the goal. Evans Stewart has it Aidan McGeady well, they're on the scent of something positive will he play it in no nonsense clearance And Pierce with it. Jordan Jones. Slipshod passing. Can he take advantage? And the challenge crisp and clean. It is to be a throw in. Just couldn't make it happen. <laughs> so the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway will key white lang an attack full of promise and a good looking ball and really it had to be further away from the keeper Will it happen for them? Can he convert? Well, 
the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. about the short corner laid into the box and he fired it towards goal well if truth be told he made it rather straightforward for the keeper well he knows it that is a real waste of a great opportunity well they're sitting ever deeper there's a slide draw pass and he's in the clear can he put it away here? Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Jordan Jones. This looks promising out wide. Teammates in the middle. Oh, he's blocked it! In search of the equaliser. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. He's driven in the corner. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Keen. Jordan Jones well, they're eyeing that final pass you just feel but then the commentator's curse comes into play and the counter attack is on options available Gooch this looks threatening and he did so well to move across and deal with the danger for the short corner teammates in the middle and a goal to increase the lead in this final will they be stopped now well here it is again and they go short just to get a different angle on the cross and then what a great finish as well good connection with the ball leaving the keeper with little chance it's a great goal. Well, a second goal for them here. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Tendai Darikwa. Will Keane. Cousins. Keane. Jordan Jones. It's with Jordan Cousins. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Corey Evans and it's a quality pass Richard 
And far from the ideal cross. Keeper's ball all the way. Tom Naylor. A chance maybe from the wide position. Crossing possibilities. James McLean. It's opening up for them. Well, he went strongly into the challenge and the result is a throw-in. Crossing possibilities. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Neil. And room now out on the wing. Luke O'Neill. Can he put it in? There's the goal! Surely now, that is that! Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. without reply well the action is going to continue for a while yet we will have four minutes of stoppage time Will Keane oh he's really opened them up here and just narrowly wide in the end And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. Winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. 